Hey everyone, this is Judy with JLB Crafts. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, thank you so much for giving me a try. In this video, I'm going to be setting up the monthly February view in my catch-all planner, which has all the appointments and different other miscellaneous things. We're taking a trip at the beginning of the month. Um, so, and of course, as you all know that have followed me for a while, I am a seasonal planner. I have the Love Letters overlay set from Girl Boss Anna. Um, if you're new to my channel, you may not know, um, for the first six months of 2022, I am uh, on the PR team for Girl Boss Anna, and we have a really fun um, collaboration reel that we're going to put up on Instagram for Valentine's Day. So I'm going to do something a teensy bit different on this video. I'm going to do, you guys, if, if you followed me for a while, you know I love ombre, which is when you gradually shift color from one from one color to another or one shade to another. So I'm gonna do a little, I'm, I'm gonna start the spread and set my color family, my color neighborhood, my, my color scheme with an ombre quote here using the love letters overlay tapes. Um, but I wanna do it as my part of the reel. So I'm going to pause the video, focus on getting that filmed because I've never done a reel before. Um, if I can do YouTube videos, I can do reels, right? So, but I can't, I can't, I'm not good enough to do both at the same time. So I'm gonna do that and when I come back, that will be done. And then you can check out my Instagram um, in a couple weeks. I think it's filming before, or it's posting before Valentine's Day and you'll be able to see the little reel then of um, how I actually did it. So I'm going to be right back you guys and you'll get to see the end result. Okay guys, this is what I ended up with. I think it turned out super cute and I did record it. So I'm going to try to edit that section and put it in here um, uh, so that you guys can see it without having to wait because I looked back at my notes and it's not going to post until Valentine's Day and this will be up way before that and I don't want to leave you all hanging. So, all right, this is all the stuff I got going on. Some bills, we're taking a trip um, and then some space to decorate. So, but I wanted to get this put on there so that I could choose the rest of my de decoration to match that because that was that was not changing. So anytime you're not sure, but you have one one or two things that are not that are set in stone that aren't going to change, start with those things and then you can build um, around that and match to that. So to that end, um, we are taking our road trip. It's actually Monday through Wednesday. So I'm going to do like I like to do. I'm going to take a piece of washi tape. And I chose this Simply Gilded because it's got rose gold. It's got rose gold stardust on it, which matches the rose gold I used here. And I'm just going to put it... Um, I didn't want to cover up Lunar New Year, but you know what, guys? It's so light that that is totally going to show right through. So I'm just going to start it. I'm going to put it right at the bottom of the page. I'm going to go all the way across the spine because I want the feeling like this is one continuous thing. And I'm going to put the stardust up so that the Lunar New Year can show through. I'm not going to go all the way to Sunday because technically the trip doesn't start. We leave Monday morning. So there we go. And I am going to grab my single hole punch and punch that bit out real quick so that I don't forget and try to put in my planner which I always do. You guys who watch me all the time, you know, <laughs> if I don't do it in the moment, I will forget. So then the next thing I want to do is um, figure out how I'm going to mark all these. So since I've got kind of the ombre going over there, I thought I might try to find some ombre boxes that matched for bills and things. Um, so I have this colorful boxes book. I have a couple copies stuck together in here. Uh, and I wanted to look to see if there were any ombre boxes I could use for that. The other option I could do is just go ahead and use more swishies and use my microperm pen to write on them because most of these are ombre with multiple colors and I'm just staying in the pink realm. Maybe I'll just stick with um, the swishies. I could, do, I could do more ombre so I could make this row dark 
medium, light, and just label everything that way. Let's try doing that. So I'm going to pick the, let's see, let's pick the middle three colors, the middle three shades. So that's going to be this one, 56, 57, and 58. All right, and we'll go, we'll go dark to light just like before. So first thing is the Delta payment, bill payment. So I'm just going to stick this right in the middle and then I can write on it with a, a permanent pen or even a um, friction pens work on it too. You just got to give them a sec to dry. Okay, so I want, I pulled all my little I pulled my little sticker bits that I thought I might want to use this month. So this one I use, this little tooth I use for the dental insurance payment. So we'll put this right here. And then John has a dentist appointment. So this one I use for the actual dentist. These are just some little stickers I printed myself years and years and years ago. It doesn't take many when there's only two of you and you only have two appointments a year. So. I think I'll stick that up there. Okay, next I have birthday, full moon, and John is working one day. So let's do the middle shade, which is this one. I'm looking inside for my numbers because I know I numbered this particular uh, set of tapes in order. So this is my sister's birthday. I'll write that in later. Here's the, the full moon is the 16th, I believe. Where's that sticker? Snow moon, February 16th. I wonder, I bet you that shows up really nicely right through the overlay tape. So let's put it on and then put the tape right over top. It does show through, but it's a little bit hard to read. So I think I want to kind of layer them together and put it over top. Just because it's, since there's graphic on the sticker, it gets a tiny bit lost. So let's kind of do this, almost like it's clouds. That's cute, okay. And then one more of that same color. And that way I kind of mimic this ombre down as they come down the page. So John works at the gallery that day. And then last but not least, don't have a lot going on, is this bill due. And so I'll use the lightest one for that. Wait, I think I messed up. I think I did. All right, we'll use this one. <laughs> I started with middle and went to light and didn't have the darkest one anywhere, so that's okay. Last Friday is house payment due. There we go. All right, and then this particular month, I've got a couple empty boxes up here and a bunch of empty boxes down here. Oh, I can use the darkest one up here for the road trip. So I'm just gonna put this on the middle day of the road trip. And if I want this to be bigger, I totally can put two of these together just like I did over here and right across both of them. Here, let me show you. And when I do put two right beside each other like this, I like to turn one right side up and the other upside down and that way it gives it just a little more um, variation, a little more randomness. So there I can write in road trip, deliver paintings, deliver artwork. So, all right, that is everything functional pretty much. So I pulled a couple kitty stickers. I have this one. These are both from Fat Cat Designs. This one with the two kitties kind of being all romantic. And this one where they're having dinner and drinking wine. I think these are actually Thanksgiving dinner stickers, but to me it just looks like a fancy dinner. And so I thought what I would do 
is pair it with a couple of the quotes. So I didn't show you guys, but the book I pulled that quote out of is the Holiday Quotes and Boxes from Amber Plans Her Day. And basically she goes through the whole year worth of holidays chronologically. So this is like New Year's and beginning of the year stuff. Second page is Valentine's Day. So I pulled that sticker right there from there. And since these two guys are, are drinking wine, I thought it would be foot, fun to put Roses are red, blah, 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 wine <laughs> with it somehow. So I have the washi tape to represent that the road trip starts here. So if I can, I can fit this, these guys right here next to the wine quote. Yes, super cute. All right, so let's do that. But what I wanted to do was use this rose gold washi swish. Um, if I can find it, here it is. I want to use that as kind of the floor and put the kitties having dinner over top of it. I love these. The perforation is so convenient. All right, so I'm gonna put this here. I don't know what's under it. I can cover that up with the kitties. And then I'm gonna put the kitties having dinner and drinking their wine. There will be wine for sure on this road trip, so. <laughs> so I just wanna make sure part of the sticker covers that little dimple. There they go. That doesn't that look like they're kind of it's sitting on the floor. So cute. All right, and then let's fit this on there. Kind of around the kitties. There we go. Roses are red, blah 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 wine. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so that's that. And then I found I have these two who are in love, and it says and I have this one, how sweet it is to be loved by you. And so I thought what I could do is kind of build a little scene with these two guys. And this quote down in this use up part of this section. So to do that, I think I want more of this washi. This is called heartstrings. Um, I think I want that to be like maybe they're in some fancy ballroom or dancing thing, and this is hanging down from the ceiling. So let's put this right here. I'm gonna go all the way across. And if, maybe if there are two quotes, I'll use two quotes. Now this is, this washi tape also, overlay tape is perforated. Um, but I don't think it's perforated. Nope, not in the right spot. So I'm going to go ahead and put this piece back on and just cut it where I need it to be. Oops, all right. <laughs> I'm just going to cut it. I want to cut it right on the line there. I don't know if I cut all the way through it. Nope, I don't think I did. I'm using my kiss cutting knife, which is a little bit dull. There we go. Cute. All right, they have little hearts hanging down from the ceiling. I know it's hard to see because of the glare, but can you see that? Yeah, super cute. Okay, and then I thought I could use, um, I could use either this rose gold or some other washi as the floor how sweet it is to be left by you my heart is wherever you are i could put a quote on either side and the kitties in the middle maybe i will maybe i'll put let's put another one of these rose golds as the dance floor and put the two kitties on it so in order to get them in the right spot I want to put the quote on the quotes on first. So, how sweet it is to be loved by you. We'll put over here. There. And then if I put a swishy, and then my heart is wherever you are. So much sappy quotes. So if this then fits over here, I can put my love bird kitties kind of representing my hubby and me in the middle there we go all right let's put one of these on again as kind of like a, a floor I'm just going to kind of center it and then let's put our little love bird kitties on there Like they're dancing. Aww. Okay. <laughs> so cute. 
I gotta put my garbage days on here. So the first is garbage, but we aren't gonna be home and and we can skip a week, no problem. So I'm just I'm gonna I'm not gonna put one on there. Um, but that means the 15th and the 1st of March. So I just need one on the 15th, a garbage can. And I've been using up the ones in this uh, Bright's sticker book. So we'll keep going with those. Gray matches this spread, okay? And then I have my recycle bins that I can use for the 8th and the 22nd. These are from Planner Kate. Lots of rainbow colors and you can see I've got lots of op pink options here so we'll just go with a little bit darker up here and a little bit lighter down here. There we go. Recycle and garbage. Okay and then I think since I have kitties on here I went ahead and pulled uh, last year's winter book because it has this Valentine Kitty page um, and I thought this year the cat's meow would be cute on here since I have kitties in a couple places and I need kind of a big boxy something there so you know, I, what I could do too is kind of jazz this up a little with more of these to put it all together so if I if I layer it with another one of these here at the bottom there we go and then another one of these here at the top like this one they're a little hard to see but I mean it's hard to see on camera but I think they show up here in real life they show up pretty nice so yeah, that's cute. Okay, so I think that side is done. Um, I think this side is done. I just feel like it's a little empty up here. So I also have found these little date night stickers, which I never use because my husband and I have been married 20 some years and so date night's not really a thing. But I thought I could go ahead and jazz up these two little scenes with a couple of these. Why not? There we go. Oh, so cute. Okay. And then Amber does have a couple of um, heart stickers here. And I found this little section of heart stickers that I don't know where, what book they came out of, but they were in my stash. So I thought I could just sprinkle a few of these on there. Um, they're not going to add much in the way of pink, but that's okay. Maybe I'll put this one kind of here in the middle since it's tall. Just to fill that space in a little bit. Um, this one's cute. I think I'll just put it here since this is kind of an empty box. There we go. And I feel like, you guys, that is probably good enough. Um, I mean, I could, I could put more up here, but I don't know if I need to. Like, I could put a little of this up here. Let's do that. I have these two little pieces. This is what I cut off of down here. So I'm just going to go ahead and put it on here. And we'll do one more piece on the other side, too. Oh, I got a big clump of cat hair on that one. Big surprise. There we go. Oops, sorry, it's off scene. So there we go. It's a little bit on the empty side, but I don't I don't mind you guys because that way when things come up, I have lots and lots of space to add them in. So let me show you what it looks like on the discs. I have my February pink discs on there. There we go, you guys. There is my February catch-all spread uh, using lots and lots of Girl Boss Anna overlay tapes. If you missed the sale or if you are waiting for things to come back into stock, um, use my code Judy, J-U-D-I 10. Um, it is in the, in the description box of this video and that will get you 10% off of all of your Girl Boss Anna orders. So I hope you like this video. If you do, please consider liking and subscribing. Thank you.